Okay, welcome to room 230. This is my classroom. And as you can see, it's a very busy place. A lot of different things. There will be three different chemistry classes in here. There's going to be lab materials out. You need to be able to identify the dangers and understand the rules of engagement. First and foremost, nobody is allowed unless I direct you behind this central command here with all the computers. As you see, it's pretty clean right now, but it's going to be set up with many demonstrations, many different things that are possibly harmful to you. So you do not touch unless directed. And the general rule is you don't touch anything until unless I ask you to. Now, as we look out to the classroom, okay, and we look forward, we're going to see, okay, the American flag in the corner, and below that is the fire extinguisher. And this is a CO2 fire extinguisher. In this fire extinguisher, too bad I can't break the glass here. All right, very simple to operate. You take out, you pull the pin. If you've ever used a hand grenade, that's what you would do. You'd pull the pin, hopefully you haven't, and you would squeeze down on this handle and direct the CO2 uh, right on to the um, fire, if directed so, if I'm not available. Okay, also for your viewing displeasures is a fume hood that we're going to use predominantly for volatiles, things that evaporate quickly that we don't want to smell, like our first AP lab. All right, and a switch right here turns that on as well. Okay, any case, some other places of note. All right, obviously there's many things in here. We have something called a safety window. I'm not sure how safe this will be, being we're on the second floor, but in the case, uh, this is called a rescue window, in the case that we need to get out, we would be rescued from this window, okay? Pretty steep drop, as you can see, but nevertheless, that's our safety window. Uh, back printer, something as we speak about the back printer, this is one of two or three colored printers left in the building, so I'd appreciate it if you do not make color copies of, let's say, your art or some kind of pamphlets you want to make. Ask me first to make color copies. I'd appreciate it, because we are paying for the ink. Here's a demonstration I'm still building. As you can see, many things abound. And of course, uh, lab is set up. And there are also some lab station computers. These are not for viewing displeasures. These are set up for viewing labs. So if you want to use them, you've left your computer home, please ask me. It's all very simple. I will probably say yes to almost anything. But you have to let me know. Don't just go on, log in, and go anywhere you'd like. Uh, sometimes they're set up for a particular reason. As you can see, there's a lab here. OK, back sink. Now, this is a no-no too. This is a place where I mix chemicals or I'm in the process of cleaning up a demonstration. As you can see, there's some kind of rusted, oxidized uh, cart right in front of it to let you know this is a place you don't belong as well. Okay. Uh, obviously, things that you don't know, you can't see, or don't understand are not for your viewing pleasures as well. As we go forward, okay, we can see there's a nice eye wash right here. And this eye wash is very simple. Okay. You're going to take your eyes, I guess, and you just open them up, keep them open, and we're going to push forward, and that's how she works. Push it back. Okay. Also, in the case of a really catastrophic event where you have spilled uh, uh, some serious chemicals on yourself, we have this shower. This, of course, is not to be used to clean yourself. It is clearly a place to, um, um, if you have a major spill or major accident here, so you would just take this handle and you'd pull down. Uh, we can see if it actually works. Okay. Oh yeah, she works pretty good. Although I certainly wouldn't uh, dare use that water. Okay. Looks like it's not much of a clean shower. But there you go, your safety, okay, of parts of this classroom. Now also, to leave the classroom, all right, all you're going to do is you're going to go out. The, we're going to leave the room. See Brandon McMahon waiting for me to be done. And down the steps, okay, and as we go down the steps, we are out through those doors to the right. And that's how we would leave. All right, and those are the pretty basics of the classroom. All right, now back into the rooms. Hello, Brandon. Hi, how's it going? Okay, and a couple of other things. Handing something into me, Purple Creative Fun, do never hand it to me or put it out here, obviously. Things are very, very busy. Okay, and those are the, the basic rules to the class. Do not touch. Do not investigate. 
Do not put your hands on, taste, smell, unless I direct you. Okay, I hope you have a great year. Welcome to room 230.